When members of the local church start using the 7Me app to record their own tithing offering, the conference needs to be able to verify the EFT payments uh, and the proof of payments that are attached to each receipt. And to do this, um, the conference coordinator or somebody assigned comes to income and goes to 7Me uh, Titan offerings. And here they are able to select a period which they are going to be looking at. So in our example, I will pick a few months before, say from July up to date. And all they need to do after that is to click uh, the load button over here. And it will show you the number of um, receipts that are waiting to be verified. And there's a little uh, checking um, money clip icon here, which you need to click. And when you click it, it will open up the proof of payment. So you look at the amount. In this case, we're expecting the proof of payment to have five rand. So this is a good example. So there is our five rand over there. We are expecting to see five rand on the proof of payment that is about to open now. And when we look at it, we see whether the proof of payment is an accurate one. And as you can see here, this is not the correct proof of payment. You have two options to approve or to deny. And in this case, we are going to deny. So we'll say this message will be sent to the um, uh, member that uh, captured this transaction. We can say it in a very nice way. Please, can you attach the correct proof of payment for this giving and then you can click on deny so what will happen now is they will receive an email on their end which lets them know that there's something wrong with their submission and they can redo it again. So this is the process that needs to be done. And if there are any positive ones which are approved, you will see a button here that says create batches. And once you click on that button, it, it will then um, issue the receipts to the members. So this is all that the person at the conference uh, needs to do. I ideally recommend that this is done once every morning so that if any members give during the day, it's a 24 hour cycle for them to be able to receive their receipts. Uh, this will help members to also have confidence and uh, know the efficiency of, um, of, of the system. At this point, I'll try and share with us what, em what uh, the type of email that they receive when it is denied. Okay, so when they come and have a look at their transaction, it will tell them that there was a problem with your giving via 7Me. Your Titan offering to Pretoria Isab SDHH made on this date for five right was not successful because of the following. Denied for the for the reason below. Please can you attach the correct proof of payment for this giving? If it is not clear how to solve this problem, this is the email address and so on. So this is the kind of email that this user will receive when there is a problem with their uh, seven me um, seven me offering i'll also do another video on how to process the other online payments but this one is specific for eft payments